The Futures Fund has been going since 2003 and it, it's incredibly important because it gives us an opportunity to help some students who just perhaps at the right time need a little bit of encouragement financially to help them fulfil their ambitions and, and their career aspirations. The Futures Fund awards support to students in three key areas. The Student Opportunity Scholarship, Excellence Scholarship and Graduate Development. I applied for the Futures Fund because I wanted to go to a masterclass that was in America with Pixar. I wouldn't have been able to do without that financial help because, you know, it's not something I could afford even when I was working. I was the first person to attend university with my family. At the time, I was only working part-time. I had a family to support and as a result, it, it did help a great deal. It eased the pressure financially and helped, us, helped me concentrate on um, my studies and I was able to get a first because of that. And I was going to 2012 Olympic trials and I needed funding to pay for that. London's a really expensive place. It was kind of the start of my senior career and it, it kind of led me to train with the best guys, uh, people like Michael Jameson, silver medalist at uh, London 2012. And it's led me to this year where I'm in a great place to make the team this year. Within their academic learning, they often have work experience or they have projects which are work-based, which help them to build life experience. But the Futures Fund can look at things from a different angle. We can support students to go and have different experiences, new experiences, novel experiences, things that they wouldn't otherwise be able to access through their usual academic learning. So it's really a significant part of our added value offer to the students at the University of Sunderland. Going down to Sky News and spending three weeks there really opened my eyes to, to national journalism and uh, a different way of working. As when I'd finished that Sky News placement, I then went on to apply for the BBC Journalism Trainee Scheme. And one of the main things that I put on my CV and on my application was that experience at Sky, which I would not have been able to do without the Futures Fund since I actually got on the Trainee Scheme. It's been told to me a few times that it was that experience at Sky News that really set me apart and helped you know, push my application to the top. So my experience through the Futures Fund was the ability and the opportunity to attend an international art fair in America. And it was really vital that I made that next step. I was ready for that next step. I just needed some funding to help me create a new body of work that was ready for that market. And looking back now, I can see that it, it set in place a lot of contacts for my future business and, and my career progression. For those people who have donated to Futures Fund in the past, I would simply like to say thank you. Um, well, I'm just a normal lad from Yorkshire who went all the way to New Zealand and within three weeks he was speaking to Dan Carter and Sonny Bill William. Thank you, keep doing it because you know people deserve opportunities. The people who have donated are the people who can provide opportunities for people to get in the game and you know get a chance and see where they end up. If I could sum the Futures Fund up, two words, I would say life-changing. If I had to sum up the scholarship in one word, it would be opportunity. An opportunity that you, you, you might not get otherwise. Optimism for the future. The Futures Fund for me was life-changing. It gave me the hope to go and do what I wanted to do and just know that there was a chance to, to go out there and achieve what I wanted to. So. Over the last 16 years, the university has helped over 160 students through the Futures Fund programme. And now we've got more students than ever applying, which is fantastic. But of course, if we want to help them, we need to have more money and that's where you come in. Please, if you can help us, donate to the Futures Fund and help us help as many students as possible in the future. <laughs>